Yeah, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I would like to welcome you guys to my gaming station. So today I wanted to make this video because simply it's time. A lot of people have been hitting me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, chat, all that. They've been trying to figure out how I get the crispiest audio when it comes to my game. And now let me be completely clear. For people that look like me, that may not be the easiest thing to set up. We not we may not have the know-all or want to go down that Reddit rabbit hole that a lot of other gamers and creators and streamers go down. So what I wanted to do was make something simple and really up to date that can carry your career in gaming or content creation for years to come. King Kong. King Kong. King Kong. This has been my setup for about maybe two, three years now, except for a couple extra pieces that I just got within the last year. Of course, this gaming PC, I just got probably about a year, maybe a little bit longer. No, actually, it's been about a year because I put the order in last November. Um, the PS5 has been with me for two years. Um, the GoXLR has been with me for two years. But what you guys want to know is how in the heck does this thing right here get all the audio to then work on programs like this? All right. Let me go ahead and show you guys this real fast. Now, OBS is one of the programs that I use for streaming. Um, I use that when I stream live on Twitch. I also use another program called Streamlabs OBS that I use when I'm streaming on Facebook Gaming. So if you guys, you know, are trying to figure out what application you want to use and stuff like that, it's totally up to you. I use two. I'm just going to go ahead and put that out there. I use two. All right. They both function for two separate things, Facebook and Twitch. All right. Let me stop talking about my stream and stuff like that. Let me tell you guys about the products that I use in order to hear PlayStation 5 Party Chat on my PC side as well as record it at the same time and have the stream hear it at the same time that I'm recording it. Okay. So first thing on the list that you guys will need, it is the cheapest piece to this entire setup a blue snowball so look check this out guys this microphone was developed by blue link is in the description right this microphone is what i speak through to the playstation 5 party chats to call of duty lobbies to people at the park this is the microphone that they hear not what you hear when I'm streaming. You hear this microphone when I'm streaming. But when I'm in a party chat or something like that on console, this is the microphone that they hear. They don't hear my controller. No, not at all. They don't hear my controller microphone. They hear this microphone. This microphone is plugged directly into the back of my PlayStation 5. All right. Next thing on the list. It's a little bit more pricey. But this is if you're coming from my side of things where you're not you're not willing to mess around with anything you do you don't want to spare any expense none of that you want to get right to the nitty gritty you're gonna need you a go xlr i'm just gonna go ahead and put it out there this mug costs about four hundred dollars now this is only for people who use xlr microphones i'm gonna say again for people that use xlr microphones booms shotguns if you use blue sparks and stuff like that, if you use an XLR microphone, I say again, go XLR. But we do have cheaper alternatives. I'll talk to you guys about in this video. But if you want a cheaper alternative to this, they have something called the Go XLR Mini. It'll run you about two hundred and fifty dollars or something like that, and you might be able to even get it cheaper off eBay. Listen. I know a lot of people say they get scammed off eBay, but when it comes to these electronics, you really can't scam with an electronic. Like, you know what I'm saying? How do they give you a fake XLR like they give you fake Jordans? You feel what I'm saying? So, next thing on the list. Yeah, that's right. Those big Astro babies. <laughs> Astro A50s. This is my premier and only headset that I use when I'm gaming cordless. 
Now, I do have an A40. We do have an alternate setup for that. But when it comes to me, I love being unchained, unwired, whatever you want to call it. I love moving around. I'm very animated. I get mad a lot. And this helps me stay disconnected from the GoXLR and breaking a port and a headphone jack and all of that. So, A50s will run you about $300. But we have a cheaper alternative. We'll talk about that. Now, as far as the Astro Gaming headset goes, because as I go along, I want to let you guys know how I set this all up. The Astro Gaming headset, if you turn it around here, they have two cords here. This cord right here is the aux cable cord. This cord right here is a USB-A cable to micro, and this is plugged into the back of my PC, the USB cable and this audio cable for the aux is plugged directly into the GoXLR. That's where that cord is plugged in at. All right. Now let's go ahead and move on to the next thing that you'll need. Of course, you'll need a PS5. Of course. But behind the PS5 is where all the magic happens. Okay. Now, of course, don't be mad at me. Yes, I don't have cable management. You want to know why? Because I got a lot going on, okay? Now, last but not least, the most important piece, not if the cheapest piece, you will need an Astro Gaming HDMI adapter. Remember, all links to all products will be in the description. So if I'm losing you or whatever the case may be, please look in the description refer back to this point in the video because this is where i talk about this hdmi adapter because man it does so freaking much now a couple years ago um elgato had came out with something called a, a party chat link right this is the equivalent of a party chat link on acid i'm gonna say it again this is the equivalent to a party chat link with a with an elgato 7 hd 20 or whatever this is that on acid with a uh, Elgato 4K Capture 60 internal card and more. So, boom. You have a HDMI cord going from the PlayStation 5 to this HDMI adapter in port. On the out port, you have a USB cable that is powering the HDMI adapter coming out the ps5 remember the ps5 has a lot of usb ports it got three regulars in a USB C. you got enough space baby now you have an hdmi cord that is going out of the hdmi adapter now this is for advanced people this hdmi cord is going into the back of the 4k capture 60 card that i have installed in my pc but if you don't have a 4k capture uh card or you're not even capturing gameplay plug it in your monitor for all my capture card people plug this cord from this hdmi adapter to the inside of the capture card the hdmi inside now i know what you're looking you're looking at this little skinny cord right here you're like oh this looks so cute this is called a optical cable that's it. That's all it's called. But my optical cable is not plugged into the back of the PC. No, no, no. Now, for all my people who have optical cable ports in the back of your PC, more power to you. But remember when I was telling you guys about this great old GoXLR? The GoXLR has a game feature port right here, literally, that you can just go ahead and plug this optical cable into. It's, it's, it's right there. It got a little controller right next to it. The GoXLR is already letting you know that, baby, we, we capture all that audio for you. No problem. We, we doing it for you. That's what you paid us for. Okay? Now, that is how my setup is. Remember, I told you guys about the blue snowball, right? Remember that little cord for the blue snowball? I told you. That's it. Yeah, this cord is pretty long, man. This cord goes all the way across. This right here, blue snowball cord. This right here is the power to HDMI adapter. This is my Ethernet cord. This is the HDMI cord that goes into the HDMI adapter. And that's the power cord for the PlayStation 5. All right. Don't forget, 
Astro Gaming 850 headset. The USB cord that goes in the back of this 850 headset is plugged into the PC. Okay, plugged into the PC. This cord right here, this little aux cord, is plugged into the GoXLR, okay? All right, now, I know what you're thinking. Pod, fuck you, first off, and I'm sorry, I know. Pod, I can't afford that shit. Give me a cheaper alternative because you you making my head hurt all fucking ready. I'm, I'm sick and tired of you. You and your bald self, help me. So, y'all want to hear about cheaper alternatives, right? The cheaper alternative to this entire setup, this entire setup, you will be removing two things and replacing those two things with one thing, all right? So, let me tell you what you need to keep and what we're going to be taking away off of this, right? You're going to be keeping this $40 microphone right here right you're gonna be keeping that that's gonna have that's always gonna be like that this go xlr exit out you're not an xlr person you use usb mics you use a, a blue yeti for your streams x that go xlr out you're not you're not trying to spend three hundred dollars on an astro gaming 850 headset exit out Exit out. I've already saved you 750 to maybe 780 on two items already. The HDMI adapter, though, I ain't going to lie. You're going to need that HDMI adapter. But the alternative to the GoXLR and the Astro 850 headset is an Astro A40 TR with the mix amp i repeat go in the description click on astro a40 tr headset with a mix amp click that link that's how much it's going to cost you to get rid of the go xlr and get rid of the headset now this is why that right they have other microphones in the game right now they got the Elgato microphone that's going to be linked in the description. They got the Blue Yeti, of course, the, 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 the starter package, you know what I'm saying? That's going to be linked in the description. And they got other good USB mics that's crazy. But so many of us are in the XLR, the boom mic wave, that we don't even worry about USB mics no more. So when they come out, we don't even try them out. But for y'all, I'm going to tell you now, it's very cost efficient. A Blue Yeti might cost you $80. You might catch it on eBay for $50. And all you got to do is plug the mic into the back of your PC. And you don't even need all this audio interface, XLR microphone, all this extra cordage. It's just one microphone like this blue snowball here with one cord that goes into the back of your PC. Now, I'm going to tell you how the Astro A40 is set up with the mix amp. In order to get the same quality of audio like I do. Now, of course, what you're looking at right here is an Astro A40 that has a cord in it. So also, I'm going to say again, for anybody who doesn't want the A50, you're going to be working with a cord. You're going to have a cord. I'm sorry. It's just, the, it's just the way it is. But if you look at this bad boy right here, this is called a A50 base station, right? Everything, all the knobs, all the trinkets are on the headset, right? So let me show you guys real quick what I'm talking about. If you see these knobs right here, you got your power button, you got your EQ, you got your volume, and then you can press the side of this headset for game and for voice. On an Astro A40 TR with the mix amp, all of that is on a little base station with a knob on it, right? It's linked. You see, you see the picture. It's a little knob on it. But the base station and everything work just the same. Which means the aux cord, the micro USB, the optical cord that you get from this HDMI adapter. Instead of all of this stuff being plugged into the GoXLR, you know what I'm saying? Because if you notice, the optical cable from the HDMI adapter and the aux cable from the uh, base station is plugged into the GoXLR, but 
The base station that you will get with the A40 has all of that. It got the aux cable and it got the optical in. The only reason the optical in is here is because I have a different audio interface. Your audio interface will be the base station because you're a USB microphone user. You feel what I'm saying? So that's what this setup is all about. It's all about upgrading, figuring things out, figuring out, you know, what your audio setup is going to be. And it's pretty, pretty simple. So let me go ahead and sit down and break this last little bit down to y'all. Now, I know what you guys are probably thinking. Pi, you lost me like halfway through the video. Rewatch the video. I will have chapters in this video about the things that I break down and how they work. Now, I know that I don't need to do no audio test with y'all to show y'all that the audio comes through the way that it comes through. Because there's one simple fact about Pod. When Pod's streaming or he making content, you can hear everything. Now, I'm going to be honest. I'm a little ghetto. So sometimes, you know, when I start a stream, I might have the music a little bit too louder than me. Uh, the Discord chat might be a little bit too low for y'all to hear over the music. It's it's always a lot of ghetto stuff going on. But one thing you can always say about Pod, you can hear everything. So the reason why my GoXLR is so nice right here is because you can hear me. You can hear the Discord chat. You can hear game audio. You can hear party chat audio. You can hear music. You can hear desktop audio. You can hear application audio, like if I'm, you know, on another app and I'm playing YouTube in the background, that's that's app, app, that's application audio. You can also hear game audio from the PC within the GoXLR as well. There's a lot of different pieces when it comes to audio where it has to be seamless, simple. And I'm going to tell you now, with this setup right here that I got, that I just told you all about, that I broke down, crazy. All right. Now, I want to thank y'all for watching. You know what I mean? Make sure you hit that like button, man. Share this with the whole hood. Share it with everybody. Let people know that we can do it, too. We got people that's going to break it down for us, too, that makes it a little bit more simple. And I'm going to be honest with you. If you ain't clicking the links in the description and doing your homework on this, we not talking. I'm not talking to you again. I won't be making another video like this again. Y'all going to leave me alone. Y'all going to stop pressuring me. Y'all going to leave my old ass alone. I'm tired. King Kong. King Kong. King Kong. I buy. King Kong. King Kong. King Kong. I buy. King Kong. King Kong. Thank